it's time. Nine years ago, the story really began when I signed a one-year lease to rent this home. It was so innocent. It was so innocent. I mean, I felt like I saw myself clearly in all of the best of all my aspects for the first time when I so confidently made such enormous decisions, enormous decisions, enormous on the surface, risky as shit. But only I knew the degree of my confidence. I, w- it, I was so certain and I wasn't wrong. I'm definitely not a voice intended for the masses. I've known that pretty much this whole life, but uh, definitely now understand that at entirely new levels as a result of the massive amount of growth and expansion that has taken place in the past six months. It's not an exaggeration to say that the previous 11 years since my awakening, November 18th, 2010, 11 years, 11 plus years, I've been awake, okay? Aware, awake. And the past six months blows that 11 years out of the water in terms of, I just don't even have words for it. It, it, In terms of just growth, growth, exponential growth. And being exposed to exponentially more energy and therefore much more shit in addition to more truth and more gnosis. It's also accompanied by exponentially more shit to sift through. And my natural tendency is trusting. And I don't like to engage in anything with assuming I can't trust it first. (laughs) And it's really tough to navigate this dimension. You, 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 you have to have that, that understanding. You have to know that that exists, that there are many reasons, many people, many things that you legitimately should not trust what they claim they are on the surface. Do not have your best interest at heart and can be very good at making themselves itself appear otherwise. And having to navigate with the now new levels of experiences and awareness that I now have after the past six months, which has included a very literal connection to multiple places around around the planet, around whatever this is we call Earth. Since that's another aspect, never was I even remotely aware. I don't think I had ever heard of flat earth prior to the past year, year and a half. I don't think so. I mean, that's just what makes, I I feel like, I I feel, and I, I don't think I'm alone, but I think there's a frequency out there like mine, which has been on like the fast path fast path of, you know, the journey, but 
was so little in this life. Like it was so, it was just like instinctual when I had my awakening. I didn't, it's not like I had buried myself in ancient Egypt texts to understand that particular culture. I wasn't drawn. I, I, I've, I've, I just have always had, I've been very kinesthetic. I need to move. I love learning. I love new things. I love people. I love teams. I love coming together. And it was just my energy. It was like my energy is what guided me. And I just was guided to energy, to experience this, as many different physical sort of combinations of energy that I, that I could knowing that I had this ability to really dial in at this nuanced level. And I experienced energy like people hear musical notes, but I needed to get, I, I needed to expand my repertoire. 